so there's a couple of people who messaged me about what I've been using. <sighs> a little bit of background to that. You don't just magically come up with a certain stuff because you wouldn't have so much value with it. I was a culinary student and on my last year there was a seminar related to specialty coffee and I was amazed with how much um, science there is to coffee. I didn't think that coffee could taste like tea and it could be evaluated that way so that amazed me. I didn't like math and science that's why I got into culinary. I thought I could get myself to love cooking even if I didn't grow up cooking but I do love eating. During my college years I really love my classes. Everything that goes in your tummy is interesting. Yes, as I finished my degree, that's when I learned about specialty coffee. I was in a dorm and I would make coffee for my roommate. Her name is Colleen. I make coffee differently from how people would make their coffee. It's just my dripper with me. I'll have a reenactment of how that went. Because we need to learn how to improvise, right? If you're learning or trying to get into coffee, you're curious, you, you don't know if you love it. So you have to do it little by little. If you enjoy the process, upgrade. And if you don't, don't, don't waste your money. I'm gonna stop my drama and proceed with the video. Before we only had a kettle. You better turn up. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rocking if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead. Go and catch me, baby. That's how I make coffee in the dorm. It's what most of you usually have right now at this very moment, so there's nothing wrong with it. Don't pressure yourself into buying all the stuff just because you think it's so cool. Yeah, you don't need it all until you realize that you want to improve a certain aspect in making your coffee. Before I introduce my equipment, please uh, take note that I am pursuing this career. Now, if you're a home brewer who just really loves coffee, um, you don't have to spend so much for this. Um, look for alternatives. Look for equipment that suits your lifestyle and that suits you. Yeah, you don't you don't have to keep up with what I have. It's not also the most expensive one, but um, it is pricey. This is the dripper that I started with. Um, it's a Kalita 102. I got this from a food and beverage exposition. The style that I that I started with is a pour over. That's how I got into coffee. So speaking of whole beans, let's start off with the grinder. Has been with me for one year already. So before this, I was given a, an entry level grinder that got broken. That's why I had a reason to buy another grinder. And ever since I was given a grinder, I wanted to buy whole beans because it it, it, coffee is so good with whole beans, trust me. And it wouldn't stale as fast as it would with um, pre-ground beans. Uh, you want a grinder that produces a consistent grind. Find a grinder that has a good build so that... I, I don't know how they call the burrs of this. I haven't really looked into it. There's a lot of coffee skills in the market. I bought the Akaya Lunar, so this is 225 And for the price that I paid, it's very worth it because I have the time, I have the weight, and it is water repellent. 
and rechargeable it has an app i don't use the app but it's nice to know that there's an app and there are different modes that's perfect for espresso i haven't gone into that because i haven't dug myself deep into the hole of espresso i use this the way she buys dog food too so that she doesn't get too fat the volumetric measures i don't really trust them because just a little drop or a little change you don't trust your eyes you need something to measure what what's in front of you something that's not you or don't trust you don't trust lines so if you're wondering where did this come from right so i've been watching that you need a steady control pour over your coffee so a little bending of this will give you like a steadier pour than just using the spout of this huge kettle so i used a rice cooker cup and i used a two tablespoons for um 240 there's a line right here so then we proceed to the kettle there are a lot of kettles in the market there's also one that's stovetop and one that is electric stovetop is is okay because yeah you stick your thermometer there it has perfect control over the beans but i sometimes get distracted so i really wanted an electric kettle that would hold the temperature for me and the fellow was uh perfect because it was um it was famous during the time that i was looking for a kettle and also the simplistic design it does appeal to me and i was always waiting for the <laughs> wood kind it's only then i realized i missed out on some small important things the carafe is uh, where the coffee goes into like a pitcher and um, not really needed. You could always use recycled bottles but you know I just like it fancy sometimes. it up i have a lot of equipment in the house if you hear that those are my dogs they're playing i don't have a microphone i'll upgrade my videoing equipment but the coffee is too much of a spend for me as of now there's this one equipment that that just arrived two or three days ago for four months i've been waiting for this i'm just so happy bro it's it's the most expensive in investment I've made and the reason why I got an electric grinder because my hand grinder is dying brewing for three people is too much and I have to take care of my baby so I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm not making an unboxing video by the way because a lot of people are doing that thank you everyone for watching let me know if you have any questions are you using any of these equipment do you plan on upgrading and if you have questions or you need guidance with upgrading just hit me a message um my instagram is down below and if this video was helpful for you please do like and subscribe and i appreciate that you watched my video so have a beautiful day ahead of you and your life peace and love Bye. How do you say that in a not so awkward manner? I don't know. But I am awkward.